Pascac Pioneers is a first team not only about gracious professionalism, but also about efficiency. Our team has about 90 students, and we break ourselves up into 11 sub-teams. 3D animation, chassis and drive system, computer-aided design or CAD, electrical information and technology, manipulator, non-tech, pneumatics, programming, test and integration, and video. The animation sub-team is made up of students who enjoy learning about graphic design, among many other computer skills, in order to make a 30-second animated cartoon that is submitted for an award. The CAD sub-team uses Autodesk Inventor to create an animated model of the robot prototype. It gives the mechanical and electrical sub-teams a blueprint to work with when they start building. The electrical team members learn the basics of wiring the robot. They are taught the essentials, such as how to insulate wires, crimp, and solder. INT, or integration and testing, is responsible for building the practice field for the drivers. They also build the pit area and bombers for the robot. There are two parts to the mechanical sub-team. One part designs the chassis, or the overall body and design of the robot. The other part is responsible for the details of the design. In PyTech, they learn about all the different mechanical systems. Nontech deals with the business aspect of the team. They submit essays for awards, keep detailed records of what goes on during build season, and deal with the sponsors. Pneumatics works closely with the mechanical team. They use pistons filled with built-up air pressure to carry out many mechanical functions. Programming, naturally, programs the robot. They design both a strategic autonomous mode and an intuitive control system. The video team is responsible for recording everything the team does through photo and video. They also record matches for scouting purposes. Throughout Pytech Academy, students learn how to do their job before we find out what the game even is. This helps us manage our time during build season, actually working instead of having to teach rookies at the same time. This also helps with team bonding, creating new friendships, and learning about the other people on your sub team. Thanks for listening for our update. Good luck and see you at the competition. Go team!